this video we will see how to use the decimator from Rhino in Boss 2.0. The idea is to reduce the mesh results so in order to have light file sizes and let's see how to use it. After define any relief in the end when we check here to add the results to the document Rhino in Boss is calculating all the results and automatically it will open a decimator. So this decimator is a new tool in Rhino Emboss 2.0 and in here we are allowed to reduce the mesh results. So now Rhino Emboss is calculating the results and now automatically it will open this decimator. As you can see in the decimator we have our result and now we can see the number of faces, the number of vertices generated by Rhino Emboss. Now as you can see in here I can reduce 90% to 80% to 50% any of these results, so when I click in 50%, it's calculating and now as you can see the number of faces is half of the original as well as the number of vertices so this generates a lighter mesh result which can be very useful for complex files and of course we can change any any percentage so it's calculating and easily we can change also we can check the display mode as you can see in here we see all the triangles from the mesh also we can see by points or you can see the normal shaded mesh. Also we can change the different viewports, so in the front, in the side, in the top and respective. We can define any and decimate by error, so this allows us to define any distance and will reduce the mesh as you can see some cases it's too much so we can define the distance for instance in this case we l lose too much detail we can check other values so point 0.1 as you can see also probably we lose too much detail so in this case I would try to 30% it's calculating and this keeps the detail and after define the new parameters I just need to check in here and the results will be added to the document so at this moment Rhino Emboss is calculating and as you can see the mesh was successful created so I changed the display mode so we can see the results and of course we can edit the project and if we open again Rhino Emboss we can go back to edition mode so this is the idea other important thing is that the decimator tool it's available from the toolbar so this means that we can use this tool with any other file not only Rhino Emboss models but any other mesh so this is the idea thanks for watching